eczema doesn't only affect the easy to see parts of your body. It can affect your scalp too. In fact, scalp eczema is a type of eczema that causes inflamed, itchy, dry skin to form on your scalp. In this video, we will introduce you some information about eczema on scalp causes, types, symptoms, treatment, and prevention. By the way, welcome to Anatomy Note YouTube channel. Eczema that affects the scalp may sometimes be seborrheic dermatitis, which people also refer to as dandruff. This form of eczema is the type that most often affects the scalp. In babies, it is known as cradle cap. Causes of eczema on scalp. Doctors don't yet know the exact cause of seborrheic dermatitis in modern medicine. It may be related to a yeast fungus called malassezia is in the oil secretion on the skin an irregular response of the immune system. In traditional medicine, it is believed that dermatitis is caused by the damage of the balance of the body organs' natures, especially the skin natures, which is affected by various internal and external factors. Risk factors and triggers. A number of factors increase your risk of developing seborrheic dermatitis, including neurologic and psychiatric conditions, a weakened immune system, Recovery from stressful medical conditions, such as a heart attack. Some medications. Types and symptoms of eczema on the scalp. Seborrheic eczema is one of the most common types of eczema seen on the scalp and hairline. It can affect babies, cradle cap, children, and adults. The skin appears red and scaly, and there is often dandruff as well, which can vary in severity. Atopic eczema is another common type of eczema that can affect the scalp at all ages. The skin is red, dry, and itchy and can easily become infected, especially if scratched and when there is broken skin. Allergic contact dermatitis can develop as a result of your body reacting to a particular substance to which you are allergic. Irritant contact dermatitis is a type of eczema that occurs when the skin's surface is irritated by a substance that causes the skin to become dry, red, and itchy. Treatment and prevention of eczema on the scalp. There is no 100% cure for scalp eczema or seborrheic dermatitis, but medications can help reduce and prevent symptoms. Learn what factors may contribute to your scalp symptoms and limit your contact or avoid them entirely. It is important that you either find a less irritant shampoo or simply use water with the optional addition of bicarbonate of soda mixed into a thin paste or emollient bath oil. Use hair dryers in cool settings. Hot air will increase dryness and itching. The chemical ingredients in these shampoos can help ease the inflammation and get rid of flaky, scaly skin when used two or three times a week. These ingredients include Salicylic acid, coal tar, zinc, resorcinol, ketoconazole, selenium sulfide. Topical creams, ointments, or sprays made from these ingredients can also be applied to help calm the irritation and stop the flaking. If you have severe scalp eczema, your dermatologist may prescribe products containing stronger doses of oral or topical medicines such as corticosteroids or others. These medication methods must be supervised by your dermatologists because corticosteroids may thin your skin and some oral medication may affect your other organ functions. Don't eat too spicy, regulate your daily food intake. The most important thing we want to tell you is, see your dermatologist as soon as possible if your eczema-related skin patches drain fluid or pus form crusts, or become very red or painful. Hope you have a nice day. Thanks for your watching. Our channel focused on facts about the human body in different aspects. If you don't want to miss these, you know what to do. Thanks again.